So what's going on, everyone? Today is the 21st of November, 2020. We're going to talk about Hedra Hasgraph or H bar to see if it's on its way to seven and a half cents. You guys can see that it's trading around six and a half cents right now. So maybe a penny away from making these recent resistance areas back here in March of 2023, April, beginning in April, and then once again in August of this year is where the market topped out in H bar. So we want to figure out is a bar on its way to see that you guys can see real quick on this particular price prediction that we've produced on october the 31st we were looking for the market in ace bar to go higher that's exactly what it did if we were to get the market right now in ace bar 19.7 percent boom right there simple okay so now let's talk about this because clearly we can see that ace bar is trending higher okay so we are going to acknowledge that that currently this market is bullish in ace bar that's the first thing we needed to know it's because as long as price stays above that trend line, if you guys can see, it will forever go up higher in price, which would take us more in line with us seeing a spark coming to this overall resistance area. OK, so let's go ahead and lay out the land and see how it looks. So zooming in closer, I want you to sh see over the last four days of trading that this area right here has been real impactful for ace bars buyers this is a sell zone this is where the market is finding problems i'm talking about the buyers they don't have enough momentum to break above this sell zone this could be one reason as to why ace bar won't go up to seven and a half cents it's because of these sellers right there position in this area okay so if i were to extend this over to the left you guys can see that that is precisely what happened back in august market did a very quick stint above this zone but then quick it came right back down market hit this zone again on october i mean october august the 19th and then it came immediately lower in price we're doing that again so that's the first hurdle right now into the market for the buyers in ace bar take a look at this on the two-day time frame currently we're still seeing those sellers within that zone pushing down the price here's ace bar on the three-day time frame Look at the last printed three day price bar tells you that the demand is still there it, it literally people think that ace bar trade at these price levels is relatively cheap they was able to close the market on that printed three day price bar up there towards the high albeit it did not close at the very high of the bar meaning that there's still sellers there here it is on the five day chart now we have 11 hours left almost 12 less than 12 hours left and look at where the price currently is closed on this five day bar. We may have already hit the top into the market in ACE bar. ACE bar on the weekly time frame. We have five days, 12 hours. This again tells you that there is weakness in selling. Even the week prior is showing you that the market got hit with sellers. Here it is on the 330 minute chart. You guys can see the weakness right now coming into the market. This indicator week is just triggered right here. So I think initially we're going to see the market and ACE bar go lower. Maybe see hit 0 0.062, six cents as support. Hopefully the buyers will enter the market there again to keep the market from falling further. There's no guarantees. Here it is on the three hour chart. ACE bar on the seven. Okay, let's look at this on the longer hourly chart. It is on the 13 hour chart, 54 minutes left. If we see the market and ACE bar close on the low of this 13 hour bar, be prepared for it to continue to go down in price. So yeah, that's what we're going to do on this particular video. Currently look like the surge of ACE bar trying to hit that seven and a half cent price is going to be rejected, restricted off of this sell zone right here, which we're going to contemplate and say it's going to have an issue with price movement higher. OK, so let's go ahead and do that. We're going to look for price to go lower in ACE bar initially. 0 0.062 is our first target, which is 2% move lower to where price currently resides now. My second target is going to be around six cents even, which is a 5% move. And anything lower than that will be a problem for the trend line in ACE bar. So we don't want to see the market go lower than six cents. 
but if it does, my second target would be 0 0.058, which is around 7.9% there. And if we do break that trend line, my third target is going to be minimal compared to really how low the market in A's bar can go. All right, so we'll hold this here momentarily. This is what I'm thinking the price is about to do in A's bar. Real simple, real easy. And as always, you guys are up. Let me know what you guys think about the price prediction in A's bar. Where are we going to go? And we'll see which one is right. Make sure you maintain the profitability. And as always, trade different.